Hello, here's Christoph again with a quick tip video for you. Today I would like to show you how the symmetry copy works in 3D code. Some people have uh, small issues or problems using symmetry copy, especially when uh, trying to copy one information, informations from one side to the other or on the axis. So, um, I'll first show you what the symmetry copy does. For example, if you are painting information like this horn here and like to copy it to the other side, you uh, after you have painted it, you switch your symmetry on. You are using this here, symmetry on x-axis, here it is. And then you use under voxels symmetry copy and 3D code copying this information here to the other side. This all is needed if you forget to switch your symmetry on to paint uh, in symmetrical um, order. So I will show you what happens when I paint symmetrical. All, everybody of you knows it. When the symmetry is on you can paint your information and it will be painted uh, symmetrically on both sides. The same happens here when I paint a new horn, it will be painted on this side too. But sometimes when you are using no symmetry and painting a horn and trying to copy it to the other side, you switch your symmetry on and use voxels symmetry copy and suddenly this side will be copied to this one but actually I have painted here. So the reason is very easy. The reason is 3D code remembers the last site where you have painted information and use it for the copy source. In this case it means when I paint here, I switch my symmetry off to show it to you, no symmetry. When I paint on this side and then use symmetry copy. 3D code will copy it from here to the other side. But when I when I paint with no symmetry on this side here and use symmetry copy again, sorry, wrong menu point, symmetry copy, then 3D code will take this side source and copy it to the target here. So, if you, for example, have no symmetry and paint something and accidentally make a smooth on this side, for example, and forget this and switch your symmetry on and try to copy something, 3D code will take this side here and copy it to the other side. This is very interesting um, for everybody who use symmetry copy, so just remember when you are painting information, 3D code takes always the last painted information and copy it to the other side. The same will happen with the x, uh, um, the x axis, uh, the z axis. For example, here I've painted here, and the z axis will paint this information and put it to the other side. Voxels symmetry copy, and now. All information on this part here will be taken to the other part. Always the last painted or the last sculpted information will be taken and copied to the other side. In the paint room there is some more, some other rules uh, with symmetry copy and you have much more possibilities. Um, maybe I will show it in one of my uh, upcoming videos. We will see. Okay. That's all for today. I hope I, can, I could help some people of you and uh, have a nice day. See you soon. Bye bye.